Poznan UK, US, Polish, Piznaj, Lisan, German, Posen, known also by other historical names is a city on the Warta River in west-central Poland, in the Greater Poland region. It is best known for its Renaissance Old Town and Ostrow Tumski Cathedral. Today, Poznan is an important cultural and business center and one of Poland's most populous regions with many regional customs such as St. John's Fair Jarmark Swedejanski, traditional St. Martin's croissants and a local dialect. Poznan is among the oldest and largest cities in Poland. The city's population is about 540,000, while the continuous conurbation with Poznan County and several other communities is inhabited by almost 1.1 million people. The larger Poznan Metropolitan Area PMA is inhabited by 1.3 to 1.4 million people and extends to such satellite towns as Nawi Tomasl, Niezno and Wierzesnia, making it the fourth largest metropolitan area in Poland. It is the historical capital of the Greater Poland region and is currently the administrative capital of the province called Greater Poland Voivodeship. Poznan is a center of trade, sports, education, technology and tourism. It is an important academic site, with about 130,000 students and the Adam Mickiewicz University, the third largest Polish university. Poznan is also the seat of the oldest Polish diocese, now being one of the most populous archdioceses in the country. The city also hosts the Poznan International Fair, the biggest industrial fair in Poland and one of the largest fairs in Europe. The city's most renowned landmarks include Poznan Town Hall, the National Museum, Grand Theatre, Poznan Cathedral and the Imperial Castle. Poznan has often topped rankings as a city with very high quality of education and a very high standard of living. It also ranks highly in safety and healthcare quality. The city of Poznan has also, many times, won the prize awarded by Superbrands for a very high quality city brand. Poznan was classified in 2012 as High Sufficiency City by Globalization and World Cities Research Network. In 2012, the Poznan's Art and Business Center, Stary Bro War, won a competition organized by National Geographic Traveler and was given the first prize as one of the seven New Polish Wonders. The official patron saints of Poznan are St. Peter and Paul of Tarsus, the patrons of the cathedral. Martin of Tours, the patron of the main street Schwente Marcin is also regarded as one of the patron saints of the city. <laughs> <laughs> Names The name Poznan probably comes from a personal name, Poznan, from the Polish participle Poznan y one who is known, recognized, and would mean, Poznan's town. It is also possible that the name comes directly from the verb Poznak, which means, to get to know, or, to recognize, so it may simply mean, known town. The earliest surviving references to the city are found in the Chronicles of Thietmar of Merseburg, written between 1012 and 1018, Episcopus Poznaniensis, Bishop of Poznan in an entry for 970 and Ab Urba Posnani, from the city of Poznan, for 1005. The city's name appears in documents in the Latin nominative case as Poznania in 1236 and Poznania in 1247. The phrase in Poznan appears in 1146 and 1244. The city's full official name is Stolichens Miasto Poznan, the capital city of Poznan in reference to its role as a center of political power in the early Polish state. Poznan is known as Posen in German, and was officially called Haupt und Residenzstadt Posen, capital and residence city of Poznan, between 20 August 1910 and 28 November 1918. The Latin names of the city are Poznania and Civitas Poznaniensis. Its Yiddish name is Poison, or Poison. In Polish, the city name has masculine grammatical gender. History For centuries before the Christianization of Poland, Poznan consisting of a fortified stronghold between the Warta and Sybina rivers, on what is now Ostrow Tumski was an important cultural and political center of the Poland tribe. Mieszko I, the first historically recorded ruler of the Polans, and of the early Polish state which they dominated, built one of his main stable headquarters in Poznan. Mieszko's baptism of 966, seen as a defining moment in the Christianization of the Polish state, may have taken place in Poznan. 
Following the baptism, construction began of Poznan's cathedral, the first in Poland. Poznan was probably the main seat of the first missionary bishop sent to Poland, Bishop Jordan. The Congress of Niezno in 1000 led to the country's first permanent archbishopric being established in Niezno which is generally regarded as Poland's capital in that period, although Poznan continued to have independent bishops of its own. Poznan's cathedral was the place of burial of the early Piast monarchs Mieszko I, Bolslaus I, Mieszko II, Casimir I, and later of Shemizel I and King Shemizel II. The pagan reaction that followed Mieszko II's death probably in Poznan in 1034 left the region weak, and in 1038, Duke Bretislaus I of Bohemia sacked and destroyed both Poznan and Niezno. Poland was reunited under Casimir I the Restorer in 1039, but the capital was moved to Krakow, which had been relatively unaffected by the Troubles. In 1138, by the testament of Bolesław III, Poland was divided into separate duchies under the late king's sons, and Poznan and its surroundings became the domain of Mieszko III the Old, the first of the dukes of Greater Poland. This period of fragmentation lasted until 1320. Duchies frequently changed hands, control of Poznan, Niezno and Kalish sometimes lay with a single duke, but at other times these constituted separate duchies. In about 1249, Duke Shemizel I began constructing what would become the royal castle on a hill on the left bank of the Warda. Then in 1253 Shemizel issued a charter to Thomas of Gubin for the founding of a town under Magdeburg law, between the castle and the river. Thomas brought a large number of German settlers to aid in the building and settlement of the city. This is an example of the German Eastern Migration characteristic of that period. The city covering the area of today's old town neighborhood was surrounded by a defensive wall, integrated with the castle. In reunited Poland, and later in the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth, Poznan was the seat of a voivodeship. The city's importance began to grow in the Jagiellonian period, due to its position on trading routes from Lithuania and Ruthenia to Western Europe. It would become a major center for the fur trade by the late 16th century. Suburban settlements developed around the city walls, on the river islands and on the right bank, with some Ostrautumski, Srodka, Kualichuo, Ostrowik obtaining their own town charters. However the city's development was hampered by regular major fires and floods. On 2 May 1536 a fire destroyed 175 buildings, including the castle, the town hall, the monastery and the suburban settlement called St. Martin. In 1519 the Lubronski Academy had been established in Poznan as an institution of higher education but without the right to award degrees, which was reserved to Krakow's Jagiellonian University. However a Jesuits college, founded in the city in 1571 during the Counter-Reformation, had the right to award degrees from 1611 until 1773, when it was combined with the academy. In the second half of the 17th century and most of the 18th, Poznan was severely affected by a series of wars and attendant military occupations, lootings and destruction the Second and Third Northern Wars, the War of the Polish Succession, the Seven Years' War and the Bar Confederation Rebellion. It was also hit by frequent outbreaks of plague, and by floods, particularly that of 1736, which destroyed most of the suburban buildings. The population of the conurbation declined from 20,000 around 1600 to 6,000 around 1730, and Bambergian and Dutch settlers Bambergian and Olgit were brought in to rebuild the devastated suburbs. In 1778 a committee of good order Komisza Dobrego Porzadku was established in the city, which oversaw rebuilding efforts and reorganized the city's administration. However, in 1793, in the second partition of Poland, Poznan, came under the control of the Kingdom of Prussia, becoming part of, and initially the seat of, the province of South Prussia. The Prussian authorities expanded the city boundaries, making the walled city and its closest suburbs into a single administrative unit. Left bank suburbs were incorporated in 1797, and Ostrow Tumski, Kualichuo, Srodka, Ostrowik and Lysina Street. Rock in 1800. The old city walls were taken down in the early 19th century, and major development took place to the west of the old city, with many of the main streets of today's city centre being laid out. In the Greater Poland Uprising of 1806, Polish soldiers and civilian volunteers assisted the efforts of Napoleon by driving out Prussian forces from the region. The city became a part of the Duchy of Warsaw in 1807, and was the seat of Poznan Department, a unit of administrative division and local government. 
However, in 1815, following the Congress of Vienna, the region was returned to Prussia, and Poznan became the capital of the semi-autonomous Grand Duchy of Posen. The city continued to expand, and various projects were funded by Polish philanthropists, such as the Raczynski Library and the Bazaar Hotel. The city's first railway, running to Stargard, opened in 1848. Due to its strategic location, the Prussian authorities intended to make Poznan into a fortress city, building a ring of defensive fortifications around it. Work began on the citadel Fort in 1828, and in subsequent years the entire set of defences Festung Posen was completed. A Greater Poland uprising during the revolutions of 1848 was ultimately unsuccessful, and the Grand Duchy lost its remaining autonomy, Poznan becoming simply the capital of the Prussian province of Posen. It would become part of the German Empire with the unification of German states in 1871. Polish patriots continued to form societies such as the Central Economic Society for the Grand Duchy of Poznan, and a Polish theatre Teatr Polski, still functioning opened in 1875, however the authorities made efforts to Germanize the region, particularly through the Prussian Settlement Commission founded 1886. Germans accounted for 38% of the city's population in 1867, though this percentage would later decline somewhat, particularly after the region returned to Poland. Another expansion of Festung Posen was planned, with an outer ring of more widely spaced forts around the perimeter of the city. Building of the first nine forts began in 1876, and nine intermediate forts were built from 1887. The inner ring of fortifications was now considered obsolete and came to be mostly taken down by the early 20th century although the citadel remained in use. This made space for further civilian construction, particularly the Imperial Palace Zemek, completed 1910, and other grand buildings around it including today's Central University buildings and the Opera House. The city's boundaries were also significantly extended to take in former suburban villages, Piotrowo and Berdachowo in 1896, Lazars, Gurchin, Jezus and Wilda in 1900, and Solas in 1907. At the end of World War I, the final Greater Poland Uprising brought Poznan and most of the region back to newly reborn Poland, which was confirmed by the Treaty of Versailles. The local German populace had to acquire Polish citizenship or leave the country. This led to a wide emigration of the ethnic Germans of the town's population. The town's German population decreased from 65,321 in 1910 to 5,980 in 1926 and further to 4,387 in 1934. In the interwar Second Polish Republic, the city again became the capital of Poznan Voivodeship. Poznan's university today called Adam Mickiewicz University was founded in 1919, and in 1925 the Poznan International Fairs began. In 1929 the fair's site was the venue for a major national exhibition Pausechna Wistawa Krajowa, popularly Puica, marking the 10th anniversary of independence, it attracted around 4.5 million visitors. The city's boundaries were again expanded in 1925 to include Glona, Komandoria, Radei, Steraleka, Debiak, Shalag and Winogradi and 1933, Golison, Podolani. During the German occupation of 1939-1945, Poznan was incorporated into the Third Reich as the capital of Reichsgau Wartheland. Many Polish inhabitants were executed, arrested, expelled to the general government or used as forced labor, at the same time many Germans and Volkstuch were settled in the city. The German population increased from around 5,000 in 1939 some 2% of the inhabitants to around 95,000 in 1944. The pre-war Jewish population of about 2,000 were mostly murdered in the Holocaust. A concentration camp was set up in Fort Seven, one of the 19th-century perimeter forts. The camp was later moved to Zbikowo south of Poznan. The Nazi authorities significantly expanded Poznan's boundaries to include most of the present-day area of the city. These boundaries were retained after the war. Poznan was captured by the Red Army, assisted by Polish volunteers, on 23 February 1945 following the Battle of Poznan, in which the German army conducted a last-ditch defense in line with Hitler's designation of the city as a Festung. The citadel was the last point to be taken, and the fighting left much of the city, particularly the Old Town, in ruins. Due to the expulsion and flight of German population Poznan's post-war population was almost uniformly Polish. 
The city again became a voivodeship capital. In 1950, the size of Poznan voivodeship was reduced, and the city itself was given separate voivodeship status. This status was lost in the 1975 reforms, which also significantly reduced the size of Poznan voivodeship. The Poznan 1956 protests are seen as an early instance of discontent with communist rule. In June 1956, a protest by workers at the city's Chigilski locomotive factory developed into a series of strikes and popular protests against the policies of the government. After a protest march on 28 June was fired on, crowds attacked the Communist Party and secret police headquarters, where they were repulsed by gunfire. Riots continued for two days until being quelled by the army, 67 people were killed according to official figures. A monument to the victims was erected in 1981 at Plak Mikowitsa. The post-war years had seen much reconstruction work on buildings damaged in the fighting. From the 1960s onwards intensive housing development took place, consisting mainly of pre-fabricated concrete blocks of flats, especially in Ratty and Winogradi, and later following its incorporation into the city in 1974 Piaco. Another infrastructural change completed in 1968 was the rerouting of the river Warda to follow two straight branches either side of Ostrau Tumski. The most recent expansion of the city's boundaries took place in 1987, with the addition of new areas mainly to the north, including Morosco, Radajawo and Kikers. The first free local elections following the fall of communism took place in 1990. With the Polish local government reforms of 1999, Poznan again became the capital of a larger province Greater Poland Voivodeship. It also became the seat of a powiat, Poznan County with the city itself gaining separate Powiat status. Recent infrastructural developments include the opening of the fast tram route Poznanski Sajski Tramwaj, popularly Pestka in 1997, and Poznan's first motorway connection part of the A2 Autostrada in 2003. In 2006 Poland's first F-16 fighting Falcons came to be stationed at the 31st Air Base in Kresasini in the southeast of the city. Poznan continues to host regular trade fairs and international events, including the United Nations Climate Change Conference in 2008. It was one of the host cities for UEFA Euro 2012. Geography <laughs> 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 Poznan covers an area of 261.3 square kilometers, 100.9 square miles, and has coordinates in the range 52 degrees 17 34 minus 52 degrees 30 27 and 16 degrees 44 08 minus 17 degrees 04 28 e. Its highest point, with an altitude of 157 meters (515 feet), is the summit of Gora Moraska (Morasco Hill) within the Morasco Meteorite Nature Reserve in the north of the city. The lowest altitude is 60 meters (197 feet) in the Warda Valley. Poznan's main river is the Warda, which flows through the city from south to north. As it approaches the city center, it divides into two branches, flowing west and east of Ostrau Tumski, the Cathedral Island, and meeting again further north. The smaller Sibina River flows through eastern Poznan to meet the east branch of the Warda. That branch is also called Sibina. Its northern section was originally a continuation of that river, while its southern section has been artificially widened to form a main stream of the Warda. Other tributaries of the Warda within Poznan are the Junikowo stream which flows through southern Poznan from the west, meeting the Warda just outside the city boundary in Lubin, the Bogdanka and Viersbach, formerly two separate tributaries flowing from the northwest and along the north side of the city centre, now with their lower sections diverted underground, the Glona, flowing through the neighbourhood of the same name in northeast Poznan, and the Rose stream flowing east from Morosko in the north of the city. The course of the Warda in central Poznan was formerly quite different from today. The main stream ran between Grobla and Kualichuo, which were originally both islands. The branch west of Grobla, the Zignilla Warda, Rotten Warda, was filled in late in the 19th century, and the former main stream west of Kualichuo was diverted and filled in during the 1960s. This was done partly to prevent floods, which did serious damage to Poznan frequently throughout history. Poznan's largest lake is Jezioro Kierski Kikers Lake in the extreme northwest of the city within the city boundaries since 1987. 
Other large lakes include Malta, an artificial lake on the lower Sibina, formed in 1952, Jezioro Lake on the Bogdanka, and Rusalka, an artificial lake further down the Bogdanka, formed in 1943. The latter two are popular bathing places. Kikers Lake is much used for sailing, while Malta is a competitive rowing and canoeing venue. The city centre including the old town, the former islands of Grobla and Qualichuo, the main street Schwente Marchin and many other important buildings and districts lies on the west side of the Warda. Opposite it between the two branches of the Warda is Ostrau Tumski, containing Poznan Cathedral and other ecclesiastical buildings, as well as housing and industrial facilities. Facing the cathedral on the east bank of the river is the historic district of Sradka. Large areas of apartment blocks, built from the 1960s onwards, include Radai in the east, and Winogradi and Pietko north of the center. Older residential and commercial districts include those of Wilda, Lazars and Gurchin to the south, and Jezus to the west. There are also significant areas of forest within the city boundaries, particularly in the east adjoining Swarzeds, and around the lakes in the northwest. For more details on Poznan's geography, see the articles on the five districts, Stare Miasto, No Miasto, Jezus, Grunwald and Wilda. Climate The climate of Poznan is within the transition zone between a humid continental and oceanic climate Köppen, CFB to DFB although it totally fits in the second in the 0 degrees Celsius isotherm and with relatively cold winters and warm summers. Snow is common in winter, when nighttime temperatures are typically below zero. In summer temperatures may often reach 30 degrees Celsius 86 degrees Fahrenheit. Annual rainfall is more than 500 mm among the lowest in Poland. The rainiest month is July, mainly due to short but intense cloudbursts and thunderstorms. The number of hours of sunshine are among the highest in the country. Climate in this area has mild differences between highs and lows, and there is adequate rainfall year-round. The Köppen climate classification subtype for this climate is humid continental climate. Topic. Administrative division Poznan is divided into 42 neighborhoods see Ocidal, each of which has its own elected council with certain decision-making and spending powers. The first uniform elections for these councils covering the whole area of the city were held on 20 March 2011. For certain administrative purposes, the old division into five districts is used, although these ceased to be governmental units in 1990. These were Stare Miasto, Old Town, population 161,200, area 47.1 square kilometers, 18.2 square miles, covering the central and northern parts of the city. No Miasto, New Town. Population 141,424, area 105.1 square kilometers, 40.6 square miles, including all parts of the city on the right east bank of the Warda. Grunwald, population 125,500, area 36.2 square kilometers, 14.0 square miles, covering the southwestern parts of the city. Jesus, population 81,300, area 57.9 square kilometers, 22.4 square miles, covering the northwestern parts of the city. Wilda, population 62,290, area 15.0 square kilometers, 5.8 square miles, in the southern part of the city. Many citizens of Poznan, thanks to the strong economy of the city and high salaries, started moving to suburbs of the Poznan County in the 1990s. Although the number of inhabitants in Poznan itself was decreasing for the past two decades, the suburbs gained almost twice as many inhabitants. Thus, Poznan urban area has been growing steadily over past years and has already reached 1.0 million inhabitants when student population is included, whereas the entire metropolitan zone may have reached 1.5 to 1.7 million inhabitants when satellite cities and towns so-called second Poznan ring counties such as Wierzesnia, Niezno and Koshin are included. The complex infrastructure, population density, number of companies and gross product per capita of Poznan suburbs may be only compared to Warsaw suburbs. 
Many parts of closer suburbs, for example Tarnowo Podgorn, Komorniki, Suhi Las, Dopiwo, produce more in terms of GDP per capita than the city itself. Topic economy Poznan has been an important trade center since the Middle Ages. Starting in the 19th century, local heavy industry began to grow. Several major factories were built, including the Hapalit Chigilski Steel Mill and Railway Factory Ch. Chigilski, Poznan S.A. Nowadays Poznan is one of the major trade centers in Poland. Poznan is regarded as the second most prosperous city in Poland after Warsaw. The city of Poznan produced 31.8 billion Polish zlotys of Poland's gross domestic product in 2006. It boasts a GDP per capita of 200,4% of Poland's average. Furthermore, Poznan had very low unemployment rate of 2.3% as of May 2009. For comparison, Poland's national unemployment rate was over 10%. Many Western European companies have established their Polish headquarters in Poznan or in the nearby towns of Tarnowo Podgorn and Swarzeds. Most foreign investors are German and Dutch companies see list of corporations in Poznan, with a few others. Investors are mostly from the food processing, furniture, automotive and transport and logistics industries. Foreign companies are primarily attracted by low labor costs and by the relatively good road and railway network, good vocational skills of workers and relatively liberal employment laws. The recently built Steri Browar shopping centre contains many high-end shops and is considered one of the best in Europe. It has won an award for the best shopping centre in the world in the medium-sized commercial buildings category. Other notable shopping centres in the city include Galleria Malta, one of the largest in Central Europe, and the shops at the Hotel Bazaar, a historical hotel and commercial centre in the Old Town. Selected major corporations based in Poznan and the city's metro area include Allegro, GlaxoSmithKline, Rabin Group, Kina plus Nagel, H. Chigielski Poznan SA, and Solaris Bus and Coach. Poznan is also where the software development leader NetGuru was founded, one of the fastest growing companies in Europe. Transport Poznan has an extensive public transport system, mostly consisting of trams, such as the Poznan Fast Tram, and both urban and suburban buses. The main railway station is Poznan Central Station to the southwest of the city centre. There is also the smaller Poznan Chod and Poznan Garbury Station northeast of the centre and a number of other stations on the outskirts of the city. The main east-west A2 motorway runs south of the city connecting it with Berlin in the west and Lodz and Warsaw in the east. Other main roads run in the direction of Warsaw, Bydgoszcz, Wagrauiec, Oberniki, Katowice, Wrocław, Buck and Berlin. Poznan has one of the biggest airports in the west of Poland called Poznan Lawica Airport. In 2016 it handled approximately 1.71 million passengers. Culture and sites Poznan has many historic buildings and sites, mostly concentrated around the Old Town and other parts of the city centre. Many of these lie on the Royal Imperial Route in Poznan a tourist walk leading through the most important parts of the city showing its history, culture and identity. Portions of the city centre are listed as one of Poland's official national historic monuments Pomnik History, as designated 28 November 2008, along with other portions of the city's historic core. Its listing is maintained by the National Heritage Board of Poland. Results of new extensive archaeological research performed on Poznan's Ostrow Tumski by Professor Dr. Hab. Hanna Kaka Krec from Institut Prehistory UAM indicate that Poznan indeed was a central site of the early Polish state recent discovery of first Polish ruler, Mieszko I's Palladium. Thus, the Ostrow Tumski island is more important than it was thought previously, and may have been as important as Gniezno in the Poland of first Piasts. Though it is currently under construction, Ostrow Tumski of Poznan should soon have a very rich historical exposition and be a very interesting place for visitors. It promises to include many attractions, such as the above-mentioned cathedral, Church of St. Mary the Virgin, Lubronski Academy and they opened in 2012, Genius Loci Archaeological Park, as well as planned to be opened in 2013 Interactive Center of Ostrow Tumski History, ICHOT. 
that presents a multimedia museum of the Polish state through many different periods. The Palladium in Poznan will be also transformed into a museum, although more funds are needed. When all the expositions are ready, in a couple of years, Ostrow Tumski may be as worth visiting as the Wawel Castle of Krakow. There is a very famous sentence illustrating the importance of Ostrow Tumski in Poznan by the Pope John Paul II. Poland began here. A popular venue is Malta, a park with an artificial lake in its center. On one bank of the lake there are ski and sleigh slopes Malta ski. on the opposite bank a huge complex of swimming pools including an Olympic size one Termi Maltanski. An important cultural event in Poznan is the annual Malta Theater Festival, which takes place at many city venues, usually in late June and early July. It hosts mainly modern experimental off-theater performances, often taking place on squares and other public spaces. It also includes cinema, visual, music and dancing events. Malta Theatre Festival gave birth to many off-theatre groups, expressing new ideas in an already rich theatrical background of the city. Thus, Poznan with a great deal of off-theatres and their performances has recently become a new Polish off-theatre performance centre. Classical music events include the Henryk Wienowski Violin Competition held every five years, and classical music concerts by the city's Philharmonic Orchestra held each month in the University Aula. Especially popular are concerts by the Poznan Nightingales. Poznan is also home to new forms of music such as rap and hip-hop made by a great deal of bands and performers. Peja. Mezzo. And others. Poznan is also known for its rock music performers Muchi, Malgorzata Ostrowska. Poznan apart from many traditional theatres with a long history. Teatr Nawi. Teatr Velki. Teatr Polski. Teatr Musiczny. And several others is also home to a growing number of alternative theatre groups, some of them stemming from International Malta Festival. Teatr Strefa Sizi. Teatr Poris Ciaal. Teatr Usta Usta. Teatr U Przejaciel. Teatr Bureau Padrazi. Teatr Osmego Dnia. And many others. It is believed that even up to 30 more or less known groups may work in the city. Every year on of November, Poznanians celebrate the Day of St. Martin. A procession of horses, with St. Martin at the head, parades along St. Martin Street, in front of the Imperial Castle. Everybody can eat delicious croissants, the regional product of Poznan. Poznan hosted the 2009 European Young Adults Meeting of the Ecumenical Christian Taizé Community. Poznan also stages the Ale Kino, International Young Audience Film Festival in December and off Cinema Festival of Independent Films. Other festival. Transatlantic. Film Music Festival by Jan A. P. Kochmarek started in 2011. Maski Theater Festival. Dance International Workshops by Polish Dance Theater. Made in Chicago. Jazz Festival. Ethno Port. Festival of Ice Sculpture. Animator. Science and Art Festival. Zodic. Jewish Music Festival. Meditations Biennale. Modern Art. The full list of cultural annual events is even longer. Poznan has several cinemas, including multiplexes and smaller cinemas, an opera house, several other theaters, and museums. The Rosbrat squat serves as a home for squatters and as a center of independent and open-minded culture. It hosts frequent gigs, an anarchistic library, vernissages, exhibitions, annual birthday festival each October, poetry evenings and graffiti festivals. The city center has many clubs, pubs and coffee houses, mainly in the area of the old town. The city is also home to one of the oldest zoological gardens in Poland, the Old Zoo in Poznan, which was established in 1874. Grazina Kulczyk's effort to build the Museum of Contemporary and Performance Arts in Poznan was rejected. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Education. Poznan is one of the four largest academic centers in Poland. The number of students in the city of Poznan is about 140,000 fourth, third after Warsaw, Krakow and close to Wrocław student population. Every one of four inhabitants in Poznan is a student. 
Since Poznan is smaller than Warsaw or Krakow still having a very large number of students it makes the city even more vibrant and dense academic hub than both former and current capitals of Poland. Poznan with its almost 30 colleges and universities has the second richest educational offer in Poland after Warsaw. Topic: <laughs> Public Universities. The city has many state-owned universities. Adam Mickiewicz University, abbreviated UAM in Polish, AMU in English, is one of the most influential and biggest universities in Poland. Adam Mickiewicz University UAM University of Fine Arts in Poznan Academy of Music in Poznan Poznan University of Economics Poznan University of Medical Sciences Poznan University of Technology Poznan University School of Physical Education University of Social Sciences and Humanities University of Life Sciences in Poznan Adam Mickiewicz University is one of the three best universities in Poland after University of Warsaw and Jagiellonian University of Krakow. They all have a very high number of international student and scientist exchange, research grants and top publications. In northern suburbs of Poznan a very large Morosco campus has been built Faculty of Biology, Physics, Mathematics, Chemistry, Political Sciences, Geography. The majority of faculties are already open, although a few more facilities will be constructed. The campus infrastructure belongs to the most impressive among Polish universities. Also, there are plans for Uniwersytyki Park Historii Zimi, Earth History Park. One of the reason for the park construction is a Morosco Meteorite Nature Reserve. Situated close by, it is one of the rare sites of Europe where a number of meteorites fell and some traces may be still seen. Topic. Private higher education There is also a great number of smaller, mostly private-run colleges and institutions of higher education. Uchelny. University of Social Sciences and Humanities Poznanska Wysza Skola Biznesu i Jezkau Obsic Szola Poznaniensis, Wysza Skola Sz Tuki Stazavana Wielkopolska Wysza Skola Turystyki i Zarzadzania Wysza Skola Bankoa W. Poznania Branch in Chorzow Wysza Skola Hanlu i Uslug Wysza Skola Umijetnosi Spolechnic Branch in Katowice Wysza Skola Zarzadzania i Bankowasi Wrocław Branch Ecole Franco-Polonaise, closed in 1997 Arcibiskopi Seminarium Duchown W. Poznaniu Wielkopolska Wysza Skola Turystyki i Zarzadzania W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Biznesu Wysza Skola Bezpoczenstwa W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Edukacji i Terapii W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Edukacji Integracyjnej i Interkulturowej W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Handlu i Rejczunkosi Branch in Wurzesnia Wysza Skola Hotelerstwa i Gastronomii Wysza Skola Jezkau Obsich im. Samula Bogomola Lindego Wysza Skola Komunikaji i Zarzadzania W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Logistiki Wysza Skola Nauk Humanistiznich i Genikarstwa Wysza Skola Pedagogiki i Administraji im. Mieszka i W. Poznaniu Wysza Skola Zawadawa, Kadri DLA Europi, W. Poznaniu, Wysza Skola Zawadawa Pilegnaji Zadrawia i Jordi, Wysza Seminarium Duchown Towarzystwa Christusowego. High schools Poznan has numerous high schools, each with a different program focusing on different subjects. Some of the most notable are Adam Mickiewicz High School, Dubrowka High School, Louisenschule, Posen Street, John Cantius High School, St. Mary Magdalene High School. Topic: <laughs> Scientific and regional organizations. 
Poznan Society of Friends of Arts and Sciences Poznan Supercomputing and Networking Center Western Institute Topic Sports Poznan is famous for its football teams, Warta Poznan, which was one of the most successful clubs in pre-war history, and Lech Poznan, who are currently one of the biggest clubs in the country, frequently playing in European Cups and have many fans from all over the region. Lech plays at the Municipal Stadium, which hosted the 2012 European Championship group stages as well as the opening game and the final of the U19 Euro Championship in June 2006. Warda plays at the small Dabinska Road Stadium, a former training ground for Edmund Szyc Stadium however since the latter fell into disrepair in 1998 and was sold in 2001 it became the team's main ground. The club does have aims to restore and return to the historical 60,000 capacity stadium. The city's third professional football team Olympia Poznan ceased activity in 2004, focusing on other sports, and remains one of the best judo and tennis clubs in the country, the latter hosting the Poznan Open Tournament at the Tennis Park. The club is a large sports complex surrounded by Lake Rusalka, and apart from the tennis facilities boasts a large city recreation area, mountain biking facilities including a four-cross track, an athletics stadium capacity 3, 000, and a football speedway stadium capacity 20, 000, which fell into vast disrepair until it was acquired by the city council from the police in 2013 and was renovated. The football Speedway Stadium hosts Speedway Club Peace Poznan, rugby union side NKR Chaos, American football team the Poznan Patriots, and football team Poznaniak Poznan. The city has the largest circuit in Poland, Tor Poznan, located in the suburbs in Szczesmierowo. Lake Malta hosted the World Rowing Championships in 2009 and has previously hosted some regattas in the Rowing World Cup. It also hosted the ICF Canoe Sprint World Championships Sprint Canoe in 1990 and 2001, and again in 2010. Also near the lake the Malta Ski year-long skiing complex hosts minor sport competitions, and is also equipped with a toboggan run and a minigolf course. There is also a roller rink with a roller skating club nearby. Poznan has experience as a host for international sporting events such as the official 2009 Eurobasket. The city is also considered to be the hotbed of Polish field hockey, with several top teams, Warda Poznan, Grunwald Poznan, which also has shooting, wrestling, handball and tennis sections, Pokstawiak Poznan, and AZSAWF Poznan, the student club which also fields professional teams in women's volleyball and basketball AZS Poznan. Other clubs include, Poznania Poznan, one of the best rugby union clubs in the country, Polonia Poznan, formerly a multi-sports club with many successes in rugby, however today only a football section remains, KKS We Are a Lecca, football club formed by the supporters of Lech Poznan, and Idlu Poznan, arguably the most famous amateur club in the country due to their extensive media coverage and humorous exploits. There are also numerous rhythmic gymnastics and synchronized swimming clubs, as well as numerous less notable amateur football teams. Poznan bid for the 2014 Summer Youth Olympics but lost to Nanjing, with the Chinese city receiving 47 votes over Poznan's 42. Politics Since the end of the communist era in 1989, Poznan municipality and suburban area have invested heavily in infrastructure, especially public transport and administration. There is massive investment from foreign companies in Poznan as well as in communities west and south of Poznan namely, Kornik and Tarnoopodgorn. City investments into transportation were mostly into public transport. While the number of cars since 1989 has at least doubled, municipal policy concentrated on improving public transport. Limiting car access to the city center, building new tram lines including Poznanski-Sizki tramwaj and investing in new rolling stock such as modern Combino trams by Siemens and Solaris low-floor buses actually increased the level of ridership. Future investments into transportation include the construction of a third bypass of Poznan, and the completion of a 2 e motorway towards Berlin. New cycle lanes are being built, linking to existing ones, and an attempt is currently being made to develop a Karlsruhe-style light rail system for commuters. 
All this is made more complicated and more expensive by the heavy neglect of transport infrastructure throughout the communist era. International relations Twin towns, sister cities Poznan is twinned with Gallery Topic Notable Residents Topic See also Poznan Portal Tourism in Poland History of Poland Royal coronations in Poland including in Poznan Cathedral Poznan Fortress <laughs>